Sometimes we all forget just how good Splatoon 3 is as a game, and how great of an upgrade it is from the previous Splatoon games. So that's why I'm going to take you through the top 50 best things about Splatoon 3, starting with number 1. Skipping the news. Number 2. Splatsville. The atmosphere in this place fits perfectly with the theme of the game. Finding little Buddy around the hub world and discovering the funny places that he can hide. The plaza posts decorating Splatsville and the stages of Splatoon 3. Visiting Deep Cut near the lobby and having them wave at you. All the different animations that the Inklings and Oxalins can have in the city. The amount of customization in the game, enabling you to express yourself however you'd like. The variety of gear in the game, from armor to beachwear to... Uh... You know, I think that the variety in Splatoon 3 in general is just amazing. Pushing jellies around Splatsville, especially since they don't care about it at all. When their character has a bad day and does not want to talk on the phone right now. Shut up! Shut up! Making your own post and drawing a masterpiece for everybody to enjoy. Going back to Incopolis to find that some shortcuts and easter eggs are still in the game, even after all of these years. Heck, just being able to go here at all is pretty cool by itself. Being able to recon any stage and mode at any time. I think everybody forgot just how cool this is. On the topic of recon, being able to take pictures to use for backgrounds at funny moments. Being able to do recon with friends or viewers and having some fun with the camera feature. Big Man. Need I say more? Climbing up as high as you can go and taking in the amazing view in Splatsville. Lockers. Lockers are cool. I get to brag about my achievements and show off my personality. I love splash tags and banners and titles and badges. They're such a neat detail, yet they add so much to the customization of the game. Playing well and being rewarded for carrying your team. It's always nice to be recognized for the good that you do. Getting an extremely undeserved turf war victory. Winning Rainmaker in under a minute. Getting quads and absolutely messing the enemy team up. Oh! Wipe a quad! <laughs> Accidentally being awesome with the Trizuka. Oh! 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 Shortcuts and jumps to save you time when you're trying to traverse the maps. Scoring constant points in Clamblets and being really great at the game. Being actual trash in the game. Man, it probably stinks in the locker room. Times when the lobby dies and crazy things happen. But it's not fun when you get banned for 10 minutes though. Uh, well, landing trick shots with chargers. Being incredibly bored and painting the entire lobby. Specific what I know, but putting down a sprinkler and just watching the damage pile up. It's so satisfying, for absolutely no reason at all. Sniping someone from across the map with an ankle shooter. Going places you were never meant to be with a zip caster. That one little boat thing on Manta Maria. I don't know why it exists, but it's awesome. All of the new emotes in the game. Except you. Landing all four hits of the Blob Lobber, just absolute satisfaction. Landing all three hits of the H3 Nozzlenos, which is the only good thing about the H3 Nozzlenos. Sniping someone with a curling bomb. Slicing through people with Spatanas. Landing fall off hits with the Stringers. Completely dominating someone with the Inkjet. Using burst bombs to combo with your weapon. When you charge up your Booyah Bomb super fast and you just launch it at your opponents. Playing Salmon Run and getting all of your hard earned rewards. The single player. Which is probably better than the first two campaigns combined. Table turn. Just a fun mode to play with friends or CPUs. Splatfests and big runs where you get to team up with your friends and dominate the competition. But above all else, my favourite thing about Splatoon 3 is sitting down, hopping on the game together with some pals, and not having to deal with solo queue. It's the best. Best gaming of my life. I love it. Nothing beats that. Perfection. All jokes aside, Splatoon 3 isn't perfect. No game really is. But I think it's important to list all of the great things about the game. I could have made 100, 200, maybe 300 more points about this game that are great, but I just didn't have the time. Aside from that, thank you so much for watching and take care. Have a good day.